they'll be able to watch in the corridors. Pierce County Election Supervisor Kyle Hawk says his team is excited to serve the county's 550,000 registered voters. It's what we live for. Now Hawk and his team are preparing to make sure Pierce County is ready. Tomorrow, the department will test their voting system's vote counting software. We're going to have a test deck that's been approved by the Secretary of State's office, and we're going to run that and make sure the results we get from that scan matches our expected results. Election workers will also verify ballots using a specific standard. Nothing comes in this room until the ballot has already been accepted, I meaning the signature matches. It has to meet that, meet that level. We don't just say this ballot's good. It has signature has to match. They have to have not voted and it all has to uh, be accounted for. And in this state, if we report that we've tabulated 100 ballots, we need to show in our voter registration system the 100 people who have credit for voting. Hawk says maintaining a closed system is vital to the security of the process. Again, But it's also designed to be as transparent as possible. All of the, of the cores and wires are clearly visible, so voters, so the public, so everyone can see it. Hawk says this open approach is vital to making sure people trust their elections and hopes more people come to see the process in action. We love educating our, our voters. You know, this is a service you pay for, uh, your elections, and we want to make sure everyone uh, feels confident and knowing how secure they are. Now, Hawk went on to say that since this is a midterm election, they're anticipating a turnout of around 65 percent, which is around 350,000 ballots. But they are prepared to take in more. Tomorrow's test will be open for the public to watch, and it will happen tomorrow at 10 a.m. here at the Election Center. And ballots are due by 8 p.m. on November 8th. But for now, we're live in Tacoma. Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.